Hello guys and gals, welcome back to Project Cars. So in the previous video, I was up to some hijinks there. I crashed a couple times. I ended up making it through qualifying, although I qualified, I qualified really low. As you can see, I am seated 10th for the main race. Um, this is really hard, man. I mean, this game so far is fucking difficult as hell. Driving these little go-karts is extremely hard for me because I'm wanting to go fast but I have to get it in my head that this isn't about speed this race is about getting your corners down and yeah you know that's that's what this race is about it's about corners I mean this is a very short track and it has like 32 corners or some garbage like that or, or like 32 turns or something like that so we're going to go ahead and jump into the main event here. I don't know. I'm going to try to try not to restart the race if I mess up, but um, I don't know. It kind of depends on how badly I mess up. And I also switched the camera angle, so hopefully that'll be a little bit uh, more entertaining for you guys. Let's go ahead and jump into the main race here and see what I could do. Honestly, there's no pressure on me because I suck so bad that, uh, you know, it doesn't really matter what place I get. I keep telling myself that, but I'm so freaking competitive, man. I hate losing. But it's going to be a long time before I could actually be good at this game. It's not about speed, it's not about speed. That's what I keep on telling myself. Every time I try to go fast, I crash, so. God damn it, I fucked up. I'm screwed. I just screwed myself. If you crash at all in this race, you're screwed, man. Well, that was horrible, man. That was absolutely horrible. I got caught up. And, uh, yeah. I mean, if you crash in these little go-karts, you're basically screwed. I got fifth place. And honestly, that's actually better than I thought. I'm really shocked that I got fifth place. But whatever. We're just going to continue on here. Um, I'm just going to say this from the outset. That I'm going to suck balls at this game um, until I play a lot more. This game has a very, very high learning curve, man. Let me tell you, this is probably one of the hardest racing games I've ever played, to be honest with you. And I'm playing on novice difficulty, so keep that in mind. I'm playing on easy, and I'm really struggling. So... So, I got six points from that race for getting fifth. All right, so I finished like sixth place in, in that national championship or whatever.
So there's another national championship. UK Kart Nationals. Again, I wonder if it's on the same track. Nope, this is definitely a different track because this track only has nine freaking turns. And look at this, man. This track... No, no, wait a second. Okay, that's right, that's right. So I'm doing the sprint race first. So the sprint race is only like a quarter mile long. And depending on how I do in this sprint race, that's where I'll be placed in the final. So let's see what I could do. I can't get any worse than I already am, man. That's what I keep telling myself. Alright, so I think I got, I don't know man, I like cut a corner during that race. <laughs> like I cut a major corner, but uh, I ended up finishing first, so it looks like I'll have the first pole position. And pole position is really, really important in this race, so. Or excuse me, um, pole position is really important in this game. All right, so that's a good start. I scored 15 points. Um, the whole, the whole thing that I'm starting to realize with these little go kart races is that it's not about laying on the throttle and going as fast as you can. It's about just easing your way around the track and just getting around the corners. I mean, that's that's really all all I need to focus on is just taking the corners. All right, so this is the final. Let's see how I do, man. I'm probably gonna suck ass. Holy shit, man. This race is crazy, man. These turns are insane. Yeah, these turns are absolutely nuts, man. Like in the beginning here? Holy shit, dude. This is crazy. Trying to stay on the track the best I can, but the game keeps telling me that my times aren't validated because I keep going off the track a little bit. Well, that was horrible, man. I, I felt that I did really bad, but somehow I won that race.
<clears throat> I won that race by a lot too, man. Look at that. I won by like eight seconds. All right, so I got another 15 points, and that was for the main event, man. So, woo! That was pretty good. That was a lot better than the first race, I'll tell you that. All right, so now overall, I'm in second place. And that's pretty good considering that I only had six points total in the in the previous race series. So in this race series, I got 30 points and I'm catching up to the leader. His name is Dario DeVita. So that's the guy that I need to beat. If I can score another win, I could um, overtake that guy. So let's see what we could do here. I don't know, man. I don't know about these go-karts. I'm not really a huge fan of uh, driving these things at all, but I'm kind of digging the camera angle that I'm using because it kind of makes me feel like I'm really driving this, uh, this cart, so... Alright, so you got the fans over there. Let's, let's, let's read what the fans are saying. I I don't want to do a Murray, but the start of things to come from Tom Wells. I don't know what the hell that means. And somebody else said, loving everything about Tom Wells' attitude this season. Looks focused out there. Woo! Tom Wells wins! And that was from Wolfpack Nice made that comment. Alright. So I got my first win and everybody is freaking out. Wells has a lot more to prove in terms of consistency, but these two wins are a huge start. Hashtag hopeful. Was there any doubt? Wells, best driver ever. Yeah, right, man. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> two consecutive wins. Noob is on fire out there. So, those are all the comments on the fan chat. So, that's pretty cool, man. I like that. I like that. I have a, I have a good fan base. Uh, wait a second, let me go back and read my inbox here. I have a, looks like I have a notice in my inbox that says, Great job out there, we're analyzing the data tomorrow. But from what I saw, there are, there were some fast laps you put in there. Come by my office and we can take a look at the reports. So that's from my engineer. And I'm not going to mess with anything on my car. I'm just now starting to get used to how this thing drives. So I'm not going to mess with that. And as you can see, so the driver standings on the right hand side, I am second place overall. That's pretty good. All right, let's see what, uh, let's see what we're doing next. Alright, so we have another UK Kart Nationals. That's what I'm doing here. Okay, so this is gonna be another two laps, and this is for the qualifying race, so. So we're in Chesterfield. This track is a half mile long, and it has 13 turns, so. I don't think that's going to be that bad because the last race that I was in was a quarter mile with nine turns. So this race is twice as long and it only has like four more turns. So, And that's awesome. So I get to start off in the pole position for this race. So that's good. Okay. Fuck, I'm nervous now. All right, let's, let's uh, see how I do here.
No! Son of a bitch, that corner just fucking killed me, man. I should have I should have won that, but there's that one corner at the end that just absolutely fucks me. All right, so I finished 3rd. That's not bad. The good news is the guy that I needed to beat finished behind me. Do you guys see that? So the guy that I needed to beat finished fourth. And I picked up 10 points. So that's not too horrible. All right. I, I really need to have a good race coming up. I'm going to go ahead and end this video. And when we come back, we'll jump into this... Uh, to this race and see how I could do. Thank you so much for watching. Feel free to comment down below. Hopefully you're enjoying the series so far. And we'll be right back.